Let's learn how to view data in an interactive 3D graph. The way I'm going to show you how to do it relies on a library called RGL. Well, you would be installing that by going to Package Installer, searching for RGL, selecting it, and doing Install Selected. Now, I've already done that, so I'm going to go right to the step of calling up the library. And then, the function we use is plot3d. And then we tell it what we want to plot. Now, it can really only take three columns. So I'm going to use the famous iris data set, which should already be available to you without having to do anything. Then I'm going to tell it I want columns one through three to be plotted. Here it is. I'm going to maybe make this a little bit bigger. The nice thing here is you can then spin it. Maybe I want to plot columns two to four, or two, three, and four, rather. There we go. And that is the very basics of viewing a 3D graph.